In this video, we will see how to set up Invoice 2 Go. Let's get started. Click over and try it free to sign up. If you have already an account, you can continue by logging in, or you can create an account by email, Google account, and with Apple ID. I will go with a Google account. Professional plan with unlimited estimates, 5 invoices, QuickBooks, or zero integration monthly plan is about 1,550 rupees. You can use it for a month for free. Add payment method to start a free trial. Click over by professional. Go to the email address for confirmation. Open invoice to go. Click over and get started. Enable two-factor authentication. Right now I will disable this option and click over next. Add your business details. Legal business name. Registered business address. Business phone number. Click over next. Add your customer facing business details. Here enter I will do business as business address, phone number, and website URL. Click over next. Add a payment method, I will skip it. My account has been created. You can see the invoice preview here. And finally, click over continue. Get started with invoicing. Here is the invoice preview, and on the left side, you can see designs and templates of invoices. I will choose this one and click over next. Set automatic payment reminders. You can use default reminder settings or click over next. If you charge tax, choose yes, otherwise no, click over continue. You can test the invoice to yourself or send it to a client. I will go with the first option. Here I am on my dashboard. You can see all your clients here. In the project, you can check progress. You can check paid and unpaid invoices. See the pending estimate and done. Let's go to the client option. Here you can see a name is already added. Click over add client. Enter client name. Email address. Billing address. Contact name. Phone or mobile number, website URL, text number, custom payment terms, and notes. Click over Save. Client information is added. Now let's add a project. Click over Create a project. Enter client name here. Click over to create the project. Select Start and End Dates. Add location. In notes, you can add estimates, invoices, and expenses, and upload photos or PDFs. I will go add an estimate. Here add items. Enter item name. Item description. Choose rate. And quantity. You can pay tax, add days or hours, and discount. Click over Save. You can also manage all expenses. Here, add photos, also you can add comments for your customer. Once you are all done, click over Save. Let's go back. Now, let's add an invoice. Add item name. Select quantity and rate. Add time entries. Appointments. You can add payment instructions. Also, you have a deposit request option. Click over Save. Let's see the invoice preview. You can see what the invoice looks like. This is how you can use Invoice 2 Go. I hope you learned something from this video. If you have any question, don't hesitate to comment down below. And thank you for watching.